Bismillah Rahman Rahim. SLOs of this lesson are give main idea of the poem, sum, give summary of the poem through cave summary exercises. Identify line and stanza. Express preferences about characters giving reason. Deduce meaning of difficult words from context. First, look at the page number 26. There is a warm up activity here for you. Lines and stanza. The concept of lines and stanza. We will discuss it. Most poems are written in lines. Like this is a one line here. This indicates to one line here. A group of lines in a poem is called a stanza. A stanza separates ideas in a poem. In this one stanza, which contains four lines here, will have two or three ideas in these four lines. Stanza separate. Stanza alag karta hai. Do teen idea ko ek hi stanza mein char lineo mein separate karta hai. Lekin ye ek saath jo hai, ek hatti char line hai jo hai, ye kya kehlaati hai? Stanza kehlaati hai. Lekin ye ek line jo hai, wo line hi kehlaegi. और ये जो चार और लाइन जब मिल जाएंगी तो उसको हम स्टैंडर्ड कहेंगे पoइम में। Now look at the page number twenty seven of your textbook. We will start reading this poem here. Its name is He is a carpenter. You can see a carpenter here creating or making something with his saw in his hand. Let's read. Surrounded by various professions, business, medicine, soldiership and education. It's heaven sent and plain for him to labor, to work manually with strength and effort. True hardship entails a great man of honor. Here the manually means to work without technology or electricity with hands physically. As you can see that he is working with his hands, he is doing a physical activity here and entails mean to include contains here this stands up mean here that we have so many profession in the world. Business, medicine, soldier, education, farmer, doctors, teachers, so many professions we have. It's heaven sent and planned for him him to labor but Allah chose the God Almighty chose this profession here for this man he's a carpenter he planned this for him that he will be a carpenter and will create things out of food for people and he is Sent from heaven, sent by Allah to work manually with strength and effort. He work with his strength, his physical strength and efforts with his brain. How to carve a table out of wood. How to create or how to make a sofa, chair, draw. So many things we have of foods. Look at your furniture at your home. The furniture made out of wood. So, making these things includes so many strength and efforts, physical strength and the carpenters work without any technology and electricity support. True hardship entails a great man of honor. It means that the person who work hard, he will be respected and have a great honor in himself. He's self-dependent, he can work hard and he earn money for himself by making these things for people. Now look at the second stanza here. He picked up woods and tools to craft for small drawers and tables to houses that will last an impression of humility and expression of equality. Though he is a reverence, a savior from heaven. He picked the woods and tools to craft and create the things with his mind. He have this ability. To create things out of food, tables, drawer, sofa, chairs, cupboards, an impression of humility means this profession here is a very humble and he gives an impression of humility, humbleness and expression of equality that he deserves equal honor and respect as 
other professions here in the world. So his reverence a savior from heaven. Here the reverence mean a respect for something or someone. He is a symbol of reverence, respect, a savior from heaven. He sent to us by God for us, to make things for us. Now look at the last stanza here. Carpenters make, carpenters create. They take the common and make it something to consider. Equipped with right materials, they bind things all together. The reason being for us to know he is a builder. Here, carpenters make and create things out of wood. They take a common wood, a log of a wood. Lakdi ka tukda le leta hai. Sada sa. Or usko make it something to consider a kaisi cheez bana deta hai. Jusko log dekhe hai. Tarif kare uski. Khub surat bana deta hai. अपने स्किल से एक्यूप विद राइट मटेरियल्स उसके पास हथौड़ी होती है आरी होती है जिससे वो चीजों को बनाता है एक्यूप्ड हैविंग द रिक्वायर्ड थिंग्स फॉर हिज प्रोफेशन हियर फॉर हिज वर्क हियर द रीजन बीइंग फॉर अस टू नो ही इज अ बिल्डर वी नो दैट ही इज अ बिल्डर एंड ही क्रिएट एंड मेक थिंग्स आउट ऑफ फूड दिस फॉर्म इज रिटन बाय अर्जुन गोपेला हियर so what we understand from this poem here that all the profession here in the world are respected and honorable and a carpenter creates things and make it beautiful by his mind by his skills and he deserves the same respect and honor as other profession in the world he is sent by god this profession is planned for him by the god and he take common things and make it special with the right materials he is the builder and the man who works hard have great honor and respect himself and needs equal rights and the carpenter here is a symbol of humbleness here you have to deduce the meaning of the following words here i want you to find these words the meaning of these words from the dictionary Look at the theme here of the poem. A nation's strength rests upon the character of its laborers. Laborers achieve greatness for their nation through their sacrifices and deeds. Sacrifices, kurbaniya. Kurbaniya kaise dete wo? Mehn sakh mehnat karke. No profession is big or small. The greatness of a profession lies in hard work. A carpenter cuts, fits, and assembles. Assembles, tartib lagata hai. तरतीब से चीजों को बनाता है वुड एंड अदर मटेरियल्स इन द कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ बिल्डिंग्स हाईवेज ब्रिजेस फर्नीचर्स इंडस्ट्रियल प्लांट्स बोर्ड्स एंड मेनी अदर स्ट्रक्चर्स थीम इसकी क्या बताती है कॉम की जो ताकत है वो किस पे है उसके मजदूरों के हार्ड वर्क पर है लेबर्स क्या अचीव करते हैं ग्रेटनेस अचीव करते हैं कुर्बानियां देकर काम करके सख्त मेहनत गर्मी धूप और पसीने में सख्त काम कर कर कारपेंटर क्या करता है काटता है फिट करता है चीजों को जोड़ता है लकड़ियों को सीधा करता है मटेरियल को बहुत ज्यादा खूबसूरत चीजें बना देता है फर्नीचर लकड़ियों के घर भी बनते हैं प्लांट्स बोर्ड्स बोर्ड कितनी खूबसूरत दिखती है तो ये क्या है सारा कारपेंटर की मेहनत का नतीजा होता है और अदर स्ट्रक्चर बहुत सी ऐसी खूबसूरत चीजें हैं लकड़ी की अगर आप गौर करें अपने आस नाउ लुक एट द वर्ल्ड बैंक यू कैन फाइंड द मीनिंग ऑफ द डिफिकल्ट वर्ड्स हियर in this word bank now look at the comprehension exercise you have to read out the text and answer the following question what kind of man can bring honor to their country yes we have discussed this in the theme and the summary in the end i summarize the poem for you what is the message of the poem he is a carpenter you can find the message of the poem in the theme also what is a nation strength in yes this is also from your poem and you can find the answer of this question in its theme write the qualities of a carpenter if you read the poem you can find the answer of this question write the main idea of the poem write down nouns used in the poem noun nouns names person place or thing you have to find out all the nouns from the poem here i hope you can do this very easily now look at the b section here on page number 29 read out the text and express your opinion and personal preferences 
We have six sentences here. For each sentence, we have four options here. You have to choose the right one. The poem here is a carpent is written by. Yes, it's very easy. It's already written on the page. Ajahn Gopela. He picked up food and tools to craft what? In this line of the poem, he refers to. Yes, this is about carpenter. It's heaven sent and planned for him to labor. And this line of the poem, him refers to what? Yes, this poem is all about carpenter here. I want you to do the three here by yourself. Now, look at here the C section here. Gap summary fill in the gaps with suitable words from the poem. We have discussed the poem and also I summarized the poem for you. So, what you need to do? Just give it a read. Read the theme again. And you have to fill the gaps with the suitable words. In this one, the poet tells us about what? About a? Yes, this is about a carpenter here. He says that a carpenter is destined to what? To labor. Yes. He works day and night with strength and? Yes, it's your from poem effort. Fill these three gaps here by yourself, four gaps. I hope you have enjoyed my lesson. Thank you.